at that skilled wrestler. Bro, no one had. Bro, I didn't, I didn't even went to the top over that. No one, never mind, bro. Y'all gonna see what it. Y'all gonna show. Y'all gonna see one the video. Cause she said I injured one of her NXT superstars. I went to the top rope and I went crazy on her on the top rope. I ain't even went to the top rope. You know what? That was the answer. Real nice sarcasm, Justine. I told you I didn't need to fly to win. I just no sarcasm at all. I know you can wrestle, but I wasn't sure if you still did. <laughs> Throwing yourself without thinking it through I is I feel so mentored. Thank you Great. for your... Another six or seven weeks here and I can send you back to Raw. What? I'm not being held hostage in Orlando. Back in my day? You sure have a lot to say on this. Hope you have the goods to back it up against me. Are you challenging me to a match? I'm about to beat your ass. Six weeks drilling drop downs and running the ropes. Or one match with a legend under your own TBD rules. Your call. If you wanted to go, why didn't you just ask? Forget it, Cap. It's wrestling. I'm gonna have fun with this. I'm gonna have fun with this. Cap's gonna have fun with this. We're gonna have Justin with your ass. Oh no, 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 no. Nah, Justin, let's stop this with the back of the boot. Let's stop this with the back of the boot.
Vamos a ver si disfruta. Sounds I wish you were. Bet you're pretty proud of yourself. I am. Whatever. <laughs> Is that really all you have to say to me? So what if it is? Bye, Shotzi. How are you feeling? I don't want you to get too down on yourself. Sometimes people just don't click. What are you talking about? I mean, let's be honest. You haven't gotten as over with the fans as we'd like you to be. You must have been feeling the disconnect. I wasn't feeling it, but I am now. Don't worry about it, though. Hey, you get out Some of my people face, have bro. long, Talk too much. fulfilling mid-card careers. And we probably won't release you. But if you ever want to be considered in the title picture, I'm going to need you to really dig into the team's ideas. Troy? The ideas you... They're not dumb. You just haven't committed enough. I want to see you try to try harder. That's your advice? Are you serious? That and to wear the new gear I had designed for you. Trust me, a new look will change everything. I'm not Troy, changing. I told you when you pitched it to me before, I'm not wearing that gear. <sighs> What's the problem? They used to call you the captain in TBD, right? I've heard that name around here, too. And Regal won't be happy if you don't wear the gear. You're telling me Regal wants me to wear that? Sure! Troy? Well, he may not know the details, but he wants me to help you. So, like it or not, I've been deputized. When you're ready to enthusiastically try this, I've got a match for you against Shayna Baszler. I'm not wearing that day. No way am I doing this. You'll come around. They always do. I'm not wearing that motherfucker outfit, bro. You got me messed up just because I don't want to wear a damn outfit. You got me fucked up, man. Uh, boy, I swear to God, bro. They pissed me off this game. Oh, Captain, my Captain. 
Have you decided to wear the gear we... No, Troy. It's... <sighs> Delaying the inevitable. Well, I do not want to wear that fucking outfit, bro. I don't like when people change my fucking outfit, man. Because if y'all don't see my Mara story with the guy character, they changed my outfit to the locker and I had to get my outfit back. It's some bullshit. That's just do it, bro. Oh, Captain. Shut up. I don't like it. But fine. Sure. Please let the record reflect my... You'll see once you're in it. You're I'm kidding not. me. I am not. Have fun out there. Fuck you, Troy. Fuck, it's still fuck you. Fuck you, try for this, bro. Fuck you. The captain is. It will be interesting to see how Cap will perform with her new, well, let's just call it attitude. The captain better keep her sails tight and bearing dead ahead, or else she'll run into the iceberg that is Shayna Baszler. Well, new costume or not, I think Cap will bring the same level of intensity we've come to expect from her. And you don't just do something like that to win a match, you do that to inflict punishment with the counter. Shayna was the one getting broken down on that exchange. She can withstand the punishment, though. And that looked like a terrible landing. That might have caused some serious issues. We'll have to see what happens. And a lift up. Absolutely worthy of both halves of its name. What a counter against Shayna. Oh, what are they going to do? Oh, look at this. Look at this power. No way. No muss, no fuss on that delivery. Someone clearly doesn't want this match to go on much longer than it has to. Shayna Baszler's defense is being whittled down. Though I don't see Shayna struggling much longer. Impressive reversal there. Shayna there keeping that stream of offense in check. Now's a chance for Baszler to get back into this match. Going for the ride. The follow-away slam. It couldn't have felt good being chucked around like that. This is quickly turning into a slugfest. And that was an efficient display of offense with that maneuver. It looks like we've got ourselves a brawl here. Baszler turns it around. Oh, oh, look at Shayna Baszler. Strike after strike after strike. So dangerous. Yoko Suka cover. Cover. She's quick to get her shoulder up. A little over eager with that cover. Oh, square shot with the back elbows. At Arm ringer. Up and chop slam. Hazardous situation for Shayna. She wrote. Here is your winner. Is my normal. Because it's just like I hate when people try to change a female style, my character style. I mean, I'm pissed. So, should I ask? Do you have to? Should I call you Skipper? <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> Honestly, I can't with you. <laughs> I said sorry, but you totally can with me. Otherwise, you wouldn't be here to drown your sorrows in the small pond that is TBD. <sighs> is it that Troy guy again? Yep. And I can't even get a word in with Regal to talk about my concerns. 
I get he's busy, but come on. Huh. It's not like you to have trouble getting people to pay attention to you. What's the issue? There's just so many rules and people to navigate. I'm getting advice from every direction, and I can't make it make sense. So you came home to complain at me? It is kind of our thing. True story. At least whenever there used to be issues on the road or here in TBD, we put our heads together and figure it out. I can stand on my own, but it's a lot more fun to tread through the muck with you. Well, are you having any at least? Any what? Fun? A lot of the time, yeah. I still love wrestling and putting my all into matches, but the backstage politics feel like a chore sometimes. You're the one who told me to take advantage of this opportunity. I told you to say yes to the adventure, not to overthink it. Honestly, I think you're holding back a little. Remember your debut? You didn't care about what anyone thought. You just went out there, and the WWE Universe loved every unfiltered second of it. You have great instincts, but you're trying too hard to toe the line. It's throwing you off. So you think I need to try to try? You know what they say about trying to please everyone. Everyone will love me, and I'll be wildly successful? All I'm saying, the captain I know would trust her instincts and speak up if something didn't feel right for her, regardless of- Geneva, I'm leaving. Fine, fine, I'll leave you be. Hit me up if you need anything. I think I got what I needed. I'll give doing what they want another chance, but I'll make sure to say my piece too. Thank you. Well, not one with ugly ass outfit. Making me wear the captain outfit for that. Well, uh, we go, we go, we have some problems in this bitch. I'm not wearing that captain outfit, bro. I'm really not. I refuse to wear that outfit, bro. It's not for my girl character picture. He was wearing a treasure and health food. The captain is not lighting up. the world on fire as of late. Maybe if she could fish out a victory from Natalia, it could really turn her ship around. Cap has serious potential. I don't think she deserves all of these nautical jokes. I actually agree with you, Saxton. In fact, Natalia better get her bulkhead on straight, or this super starboard will have her tied up in knots and capsized in no time. That's oh, cool. Why do I even try? Pulling him in for the ball breaker. Right to the lower back. I cannot imagine how your knee would feel after delivering that move on such a larger opponent. Face first off the knee. And the boat struggling a bit to stay afloat there. She still has a lot of time to recover, though. Quickly hoisting him up. Snap, pile driver. We've seen how damaging pile drivers can be, and that one looked particularly painful. And Natalia dodges there. Pulling him in for the ballbreaker. Right to the lower back. Took a lot of power to pull that off, but you have to do all you can to break down the larger opponent. Momentum is clearly against Natalia now. now. I don't know if Natalia can withstand this. And it's Natalia with the reversal. At last, Natalia keeping that string of offense in check. Now he was getting like grinded that down, that but just created a chance to change things. Oh, man, spine-crushing impact. We all know targeting the back, the spine, is a great way to weaken a larger opponent. I need to tie it. Video, motherfucker. Running knee! Closed fist punch to the jaw. That's one way to break up a move. The follow-away slam. We didn't expect that. You don't see someone of their size get handled like that too often. Big time spine buster. Could lead to a big time win. 
Oh, look at this. Oh, pump handle. And a gut buster. Nice. Boom. Hard forearm shot. And there's more. My goodness. Wow. Boom. Legs are spread. Oh, my God. Double leg drop. Clearly against Natalya now. I don't know if Natalya can withstand this. Strong Whoa. kick. My goodness. Kick to the gut. Hoisting their opponent up. And driven down in the final prayer. Shoulders down. This could be the one that does it for her. And that's it. The captain has sunk the boat's battleship with some... I had nothing to shoot. Not again. Is this really how you see me? You know what? I've done everything they've asked of me. I've done everything you all have asked of me. Wearing dumb gear, playing nice with appearances, Taking bad advice from WWE veterans. <sighs> and you know what I've realized? <sighs> no one knows my potential better than me. I am not just a spoke on this wheel. <sighs> and I am not gonna wait until I'm at rock bottom to take control of my future. This is my story. And I'm taking it back. Uh, this. Are we still on? I hope uh, I'm not just making you wear this ugly ass outfit I do not want to wear. I'm pissed. What do you think you're doing? If you think you could just do whatever you want without any consequences, that... <laughs> that felt really good. It was certainly unexpected. I don't recall a promo being planned for this evening. I already told her. Shut up, Troy. Thank you. I don't Damn. recall a promo being planned. Haven't seen that sort of fire from you since your debut. I'm not apologizing for what I said. I don't recall anyone asking you to. But if you have more comfortable places to be than WWE, I'd be happy to release you from your contract. That's how it's gonna be. Yes, there have to be consequences for shut, shut up, up, Troy. Troy. Troy but I have to down. ask. Why did you sign with WWE in the first place? Sir? Did you sign here to be comfortable? I didn't sign here to dog and pony show dumb creative decisions or feel like I should be thankful for every scrap. You're a talented wrestler. But you can do that anywhere. If you came to WWE to be a superstar, to do what you can only do somewhere with the reach of WWE, to not just do the work, but to live the fantasy. I'm going to give you the greatest gift I can offer. <laughs> Best of luck in her future endeavors. Shut, Shut up, up, Troy. Troy. Damn, we took... Troy Freedom. talk too much, bro. Damn. Get uncomfortable. That nigga annoying, bro. Take big bro. swings. Not just in the ring, but out of it. You want to be a WWE superstar? I think you might just have it inside you. Just promise me three things, and I'll have your back every step of the way. What's that? Put your whole heart into it, and don't be afraid to fail. It'll hold you back if you only attempt what you know you can do. Do those things, and I'll make sure your spot here is safe, whatever happens. So, what do you think? I'm intrigued. And I'm in. Brilliant. But that was only two things. What's the third? Oh, right you are. 
Promise me you'll never wear that ridiculous outfit. That I never approved ever again. That won't be a problem. You've got yourself a deal. I'm a big jerk, boy. Troy. Fuck you, bitch. We, we got a pipe bomb. We have pipe bomb. I don't know what the name of this video. You heard what I'm gonna do. You wanna baby. You heard what I'm gonna do. You wanna really be at the Davis episode live live at this and you better get a comfortable start and have some fun and sports story. And you knew must be you knew must play story type big swing. You wanna take it your new place in your career, you will see you be able to come back and play other sports stories just not right away. So you choose carefully, but but not too carefully. After all, just let. Rhea Ripley, Alyssa Bliss, Liv Morgan. Matter of fact, let me talk to Rhea Ripley because she's one of the greatest. Well, she's a legend right now. What are you looking at? What's with the attitude? Screw you. Attitude is what makes me. That and my brutality in the ring. Hmm. Brutality. Did I stutter? Can you show me how to harness brutality in the ring? You? <laughs> you don't understand what you're talking about. I had some pretty wild matches before coming to WWE. I know more about it than you think. Brutality is about more than just being powerful and fierce in the ring. It's making people fear you and what you're doing next. It's being unexpected. It's bringing the chaos without restraint. That. I want to do that. I want you to show me how to harness brutality. What, do I have a sign that says free lessons or something? I can't help you. You can help yourself, though. Provided you're not too weak. I'm certainly not too weak. Then cause some chaos and do it somewhere unexpected. Hmm. Maybe a different brand, then. Sure. Show up unannounced and decimate some opponents just for the hell of it. That's a pretty solid calling card. Hey, but I'm not going to hold your hand. Who are you going to actually take out? Feeling like Chelsea Green and Zelina Vega could use some chaos. Just don't play nice when you get there. Kind of defeats the purpose. So we got a thousand million. We still don't know why the captain decided to insert herself into this match, but the WWE Universe is excited to see her. It certainly makes the match more interesting. Well, this move is somewhat unexpected from the captain. We'll have to see if it's a one-time thing or a sign of a new attitude. Attack Chelsea with a chair. Her attack. Selena with a Kindle stick. All right, back to this. Oof. But here comes the fire. Close line. Off with their head. Drop. Devastating kick. What are you doing, man? Hooked up and did he? Oh, it can't be enough, can it? And she gets a quick oh. kick out. No, nah, not yet. Too early. So many ways to get hit with this kind of stick. And misses on the springboard. That's right. Yep. We need to get some of this kind of stick. Outside of the ring now. What's the plan here? Oh. 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 Chelsea's pulled in. Ooh, dropped right on their face. That's See it drop kick not really connects. Close line. That's really not gonna do. I don't know what they're looking for here. Russian leg sweep. Battling at ringside can be very unforgiving. You have to be careful out there. No protection out here. No safe confines. 
Well, well, keeping oh, the match alive. It's not over yet. Kick to the stomach puts an end to that. Reversal on top of reversal. Pretty drop kick. Somehow. Zelina gets out of harm's way. Oh, look at that draw. Right into a kick. Chelsea Green laying down the gauntlet for their opponent. And both athletes showing that they have each other's number. Showing some extra scouting, knowing how to answer a counter with a counter of your own. Rich in the arm. Oh. Line. She's lost some of that energy she had earlier. This should come as no surprise. In a havoc-filled triple threat, you're going to take some big hits. Looked at Wobbly in the corner. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh. No way. Yes way. Choke slam. Zelina is in big, big trouble. Check out this display of power. Lifted all the way up and driven down in the final yes. prayer. Oh. Is it A triple threat. What a performance. Huge win here in this triple threat match. Oh, Dolly did what he did. I got what he did, bro. Okay, so you can at least pretend to have what it takes. Although maybe it was a one-off. What's wrong with pretending? Fake it till you make it, right? I like watching people flounder. It's fun. And you're wrong. Everyone can see right through you. The locker room, the WWE universe. I'm not convinced. Who hurt you? What? No, seriously? Who hurt you? Chaos is one thing, but my brutality has a message. Every time I step into the ring, I'm making a statement to the world that there are no limits to what I'll do to get what I want. So next time you step in the ring, consider what you're fighting for. What makes you angry enough to go all the way? Everyone else be damned. And who you who I'm going after? For instance, do you want to challenge the toughest of the I'm making a statement. I can out brutalize the most vicious opponents. I'm demanding a match with Shayna Baszler. Demanding. I like it. And work on your gear. If you're gonna be associated with me, you'd better look the part. So we're associated. Shut up. That hey, uh, you have to tell me to shut up like that. Even though you're sexy as fuck, but you have to tell me like you have to tell me to shut up. I was gonna have everything pick up to train me. Probably one week. We probably will have a good ass in two weeks, but 